Oh god. <laughs> I legit thought that was a Ferris wheel for half a second. <laughs> it's just a guess, but I'm thinking everyone in Lothering is aware of the approaching Darkspawn horde. Boopy. Boopy. Ugh. Get it together, game. Let me pet every dog there is. I hear those bandits are back again. Why don't the Templars kill them? I seriously have to go back out there and smack their asses again? I'm not complaining. I'm just curious. Back but off. I... I have the right to I... charge what I wish. You profit from their misfortune. I should have the Templars give away everything in your carts. The heck? You wouldn't dare. Any of you step too close to my goods and I'll... So it's so nice to see everyone working together in a crisis. Warms the heart. Oh, you there. You look able. Would you care to make a tiny profit helping a beleaguered businessman? Haha, <laughs> <laughs> you're profiteering, rufflings and feathers. You say that, yes. The nerve of these people. He is charging outlandish prices. The things people desperately need. Their blood is filling his pockets. Mm. His only survival of the fittest. All of these Cretans would do the same in his shoes, given the chance. I have limited supplies. The people decide what those supplies are worth to them. You bought most of your wares from these very people last week. Now they flee for their lives, and you want to talk business? Look, stranger. I've a hundred silvers if you drive this rabble off, starting with that priest. I'm an honest merchant, nothing more. Uh... You don't think you're being a little unscrupulous? <laughs> Look, dude, uh, I'm a giant jerk, that's for sure, but this is kind of... greasy. Would it help these folks if they could buy no goods at all? They spend their very last coin because they are desperate, and this man preys upon them as surely as the bandits outside the city. Ah, I'm not arguing anymore. Drive off this woman and get your hundred silvers. Otherwise, I'm taking my wagon and leaving. I think you can compromise and still make a profit. Perhaps. If that woman agrees, I'm allowed to charge something. Do what you must. So long as the prices do not beggar the needy. Fine, fine, done. And since you don't look too needy, normal prices for you. So, we have come to solve every squabble in the village personally. My, but the Darkspawn will be impressed. Shut up, Morgan. I get XP for it. Assistance. May the Maker watch over your path. Morgan, you are really bitchy. I'm, ugh, I'm getting on my nerves. Oh, wait it. Hey, that's a thing. Iron dagger, I'll take that. You are locked. So I won't take you yet. Eh. Well, <laughs> don't suppose you're looking to buy something. Uh, well, I could. Uh, what you got? All right, just don't buy everything up. Oh, <laughs> don't worry. I am probably intending to do far more selling than buying. Hey, I'm persuasive. Uh oh. <laughs> Ooh, ooh, ooh. See, you and I are gonna not see eye to eye on everything. God damn it. <laughs> I'm gonna making everybody in my party hate me. Damn it. Shadow, don't give me away. <laughs> Trying to rob this guy. <laughs> Robbed, child. I'm scared. When are we going home? Robbed man. Greetings to you, good sir. If Aww. it isn't too much to ask, Look would you spare some bread or, or anything? I got lyrium. <laughs> would you like some lyrium? What happened to you guys? We thought it would be safer in Lothering. That the Terran would bring his soldiers here. But bandits attacked us and took everything. Our food, our clothes, my daughter's pet lamb. Nobody cares about a few elves like us. Surely you understand. Uh, I do, but I obviously see that you are wearing clothes. 
So your story is already suspect. Okay. All right. Now we're ready to move. Oh, hey. Ah, uh, the Chantry board. Yes, let us run errands for the betterment of mankind as well as a few coppers. Okay, look. Number one, those coppers are important. Number two, betterment of mankind is always good. And number three, the more experience we get, the faster you level. What the hell is going on? And Eileen spoke unto the masses. My hearth is yours. My bread is yours. My life is yours. For all who walk in the sight of the Maker are one. Um, hello. <laughs> <laughs> Smile back. Let all repeat the chant of light. Only the word dispels the darkness upon us. Incorrect. He can't answer you. He's chanted Devons. Uh, is he... Is he a little broken? <laughs> no, he's a chanter. One of them that can only say the chant of light. His board has letters of good deeds to be doing. My father fixed Widow Allison's roof ones, and the charter paid him, he did. A learned child is a blessing upon his parents and onto the maker. Huh, so it's like a vow of silence then, and he can't talk like a normal human. Unless it's the chant of light, no. And so Rajmael in the heathen temple recanted. Speak only the word, sing only the chant. Then the Golden City is thine, spoke Andraste. <laughs> oh my god! These are... Oh, oh. <laughs> no! Oh man, I really, I really want to. But we will not because... Anything interesting Blessed on the board? Blessed are the peacekeepers, champions of the just. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, I killed those guys. Killed them? That's wonderful news. Perhaps our belongings are still there. The I can't thank you enough, Brent. Even if we don't get everything back, it's it's good to know others will be safe. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they ate that lamb. Was it me, or did that look like the lady who played Jean Grey? Okay, what's the problem now? Have you seen my mother? Beat it! <laughs> that depends. <laughs> Who is she? She's really tall, and she has red hair. We live on a big farm hold, all of us. Yeah. To main men with swords came, and Mother told me to run to the village as fast as I could, so I did. Aren't she, she just nauseatingly right adorable? Me. But I've been waiting and waiting, and I can't see her. Yeah, well, you can tag along for a Mother bit. I said I wasn't to go with anyone. I'm supposed to wait for her here, in the village. Do you know where your dad is? He went with William to the neighbors yesterday, but he didn't come back. Why not? Why would she leave me here? Okay. Here, buddy, do you know what a dark spawn is? Okay, uh, do you know what mangled corpse means? But she must be coming. I don't know. Maybe I should go home and look for her. Yeah, he's gonna tell me he doesn't go with strangers. I'll go. No, I'm big enough to go myself. The main men must be gone by now. Uh oh. Uh oh. Hmm. <laughs> That's gonna come back and haunt me. Ugh. Fuck. I'm such a sucker. Mother said I wasn't to go with anyone. I'm supposed to wait for her here, in the village. Okay. <laughs> Got a 50-50 shot here. Possible no child die. Hmm. Let's buy him off. A whole silver! Wow, thank you. So, um, are you really an elf? 
Nah, I stapled these ears on for fashion. <laughs> Father says elves aren't very nice, but you're nicer than everybody here. Thank you for helping me. Haha! <laughs> Child death avoided. Well, let's take a look, see what we got. Bandits, bandits everywhere! Hmm. Okay, I'll take this. Might as well. What the hell is. Take your children. What is. The legions of evil are on your doorstep! They will feast upon our hearts! You there is nowhere to run! This evil will cover the world like a plague of locusts! Uh, Please, you're scaring the children! A bit? Better to slit their throats now than let them suffer at dark spawn hands! Okay, we there, need to talk. One of their minions is already amongst us! This woman bears their evil stench! Can you not see the vile blackness that fills her? Are you talking about me or Morgan? Because if you're talking about Morgan, like, I get it, but she's not that bad. If you're talking about me, though, we need to... We have... Hmm. Why don't you maybe not shout so much? I watch the Black Horde descend on my people! I will not be silent! Please stop! Somebody shut his mouth! But isn't he right? The ban left us. We're going to die. This minion is but the first of those who will destroy us! Okay. Dude. Alright. What happened? Let's try and talk this out. My family. My clan. Those creatures butchered them all. Some of us fled here. But we cannot escape the dog spawn! We can? Look. Come on, calm down, Jen. Okay, I mean, Yavara, that must have been horrible. How did you escape? I... I ran. Hearing my wife's screams as they dragged her off. She had hair the same color as yours. I'm sorry for your loss. Why am I here? I still know how to go! <laughs> he was right, wasn't he? There's no hope for us. Um, incorrect. There is always hope. Muster your courage. You're right. We can't give up. Damn straight. But we can't fight. <clears throat> what are we supposed to do? You play we can't bait. lie down and die either. We must go north to Denerim. Uh, well, hold on. Denerim might not be the best place. Uh, oh shit. Your king is dead! There is no hope! I don't want to talk to it. Maybe with that blasted chasing gone, my headache will go as well. I mean, he was really loud. I agree with you 100% there. No, oh, good. Another thing for me to sell later. Yeah. <sighs> There's gotta be a merchant around here somewhere. So let's talk about your mother. Just wanna for a moment. get this. I'd rather talk about your mother. Well, there's nothing to talk about. And besides, isn't your mother a scary witch who lives in the middle of a forest? Isn't your Much mother a whore? Do you, you perhaps? Deserve. You would find the moss growing upon a stone. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I should have seen that coming. I really should have. Interesting. You know what's more interesting than that? Apostates, mages outside of the tower. That's illegal, you know. You did not read. <laughs> Don't suppose you're looking to buy something? Nope. <laughs> Bandits, bandits everywhere. Not a drop to drink. Except for that booze I found. Hello, Devin. And Eileen spoke unto the masses. My Come heart on. is yours. My <laughs> bread is yours. My life is yours. Blessed are the peacekeepers. Champions of the just. There's a tavern up here. 
If you seek refuge in the Chantry, there's simply no room left. Oh wait, that's the Chantry? Uh, so you're closed. We turn none aside, but we, we simply don't have room for anyone to sleep. Oh, that's Priests okay. Priests are within if you seek to offer devotion to the Maker, however. May he protect us all. Okay. Uh, did you know there were bandits on the highway? Were? Did you drive them off? Well, so Brian will appreciate that. Uh, I did. Uh, awesome. Have you heard any news? Not since Terran Loghain passed by with his army. It's a shame about the king. But with the Darkspawn coming, few can think of anything else. Yeah, who's in charge of the Chantry, though? The revered mother runs the Chantry itself, ah. and Sir Bryant heads the Templar stationed here. Oof. I don't know how I like about these Templars. Make her watch over you. And also with you. Oh. It's so hard not to be a giant dickhead in this town. Where are you from? Let's go to the Ferris wheel. Wee. Oh. A quest. Hello, a uh, stranger. I don't suppose you know anyone that can make traps. Maybe those Old one Balin said that Dark's farm may be coming soon. He's got traps on his farm. I figured I'd put a few on my lands. Oh yeah, Balin sure. That'll keep the devil out. Poison his traps. I just want normal traps. <laughs> Bitch has what now? Oh, he doesn't have any poison yet, thank the maker. So his fields are just full of traps. He can be a bit eccentric. I'd say so. None to be had. Balin has all the traps in the village in his fields. Sorry, I can't uh, make them. I didn't mean to bother you. Sorry. It's be a rogue's quest. I don't have one of those yet. We are the only hope of protection okay. this village Goodbye. has now, and I will not abandon them. That is all. May the Maker have mercy on us. And break. Oh, you're Sir Brian. Yes, my lady. Who might you be? Well, <clears throat> I am the Grey Warden, Yavara. I see. I am Sir Bryant, commander of the Lothering Templars. I would say Turn it's Logan nice declared you, all Grey Wardens traitors responsible for the King's death. Wait, what? You know this, I hope. Uh... No, and we did not do that. I don't believe the Grey Wardens would be as careless or malicious as the Tan claims. But either way, there it is. It is best you not linger, though. Just in case. Mm hmm. Hey, <clears throat> I was told to talk to you about the bandits outside the village. Maker's breath. How many times must we drive them off? Oh, not anymore. Tee hee hee. Uh, one less. I got rid of them. Indeed. They're gone. Yeah. It's true. I saw the bastard running for the hills myself. That's an impressive feat indeed. Will you accept a small reward for your efforts? Always. Thank you very if much. If it interests you, there is a chanter's board outside full of quests that need doing. Quests, huh? The chanters even offer pay for some of them. Now, unless there's something else you need. I feel like you're trying to push me away, but hold on. I need some information. If the matter is important, certainly. Well... Are you anything... Any recent news? Other than the Darkspawn horde bearing down on us, <clears throat> none of it is good. Teon Loghain is set to declare himself king, I hear. Wait, what? Disaster piled on disaster. Uh... I'm sorry, say again? Teon Loghain has no legitimate claim on the throne. Right. He may be a hero and his daughter may be queen, but he is a commoner. And the king's corpse is barely cold. If Arl <clears throat> Eamon was able to intervene, perhaps it would not have gone this far. Wait. I do not care who takes the throne. Only fools fight over who owns a cottage while it burns down around them. So wait, you said if he was here, is something wrong with Arl Eamon? Arl Eamon has fallen ill, and his knights are on a quest for the sacred urn filled with Andraste's ashes, said to cure any malady. He must be very ill if they chase miracles as the only cure. Uh, One of the Arl's knights, Sir Donal, is here searching for fantasies while... Never mind. Ask him if you care about this foolishness. I see. 
Uh, well, I, you know, I think I travel asked. safely, and may the Maker watch over you. And, and also with you. Just how smart are Mabari supposed to be? Anyway? Shut up, Alistair. Do you think they understand everything we say? Oh, is that so? You could just be listening to the tone of my voice. You could be an utter moron, for all we know. <laughs> hey, 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 now. <laughs> There's nothing saying that a moron can't be cute and adorable. Who's the cute and adorable puppy? Ignorance is bliss, isn't it? That's what the Chantry kept telling me, anyhow. Chickens, 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 chickens. Yeah, I... Jeez Louise. 